The Realtors Relief Foundation was created to help homeowners with disaster relief. And there's a half million dollars that's been set aside to help Guamanian property owners who were displaced in May due to Typhoon Mawar. The grant came from the Realtors Relief Foundation, which is an arm of the National Association of Realtors. And the beauty of this, Jason, uh, this is uh, since 20 plus years ago that this was founded by a few good men and women, uh, leaders of the National Association of Realtors when the 9-11 happened. And after that, uh, they made sure that it becomes sustainable. As they have been for the past few Saturdays and will continue through through the end of September, the Guam Association of Realtors was helping locals through the application process. So we're going to be here every Saturday, uh, 12 to 5, and we'll be here all the way until September 30 or until such time that we've exceeded the 400 applications or the 500,000 is exhausted. Up to $1,250 may be awarded per household for qualified applicants. If they uh, moved in with their family for a few days, can they qualify? And the answer really is no. Um, you, you have to have been displaced because of the typhoon um, and moved into another or you know started a new lease agreement uh, because of that move and just like the swiftness of getting approved money from fema and the sba with those agencies disaster relief efforts the turnaround time is swift with the realtors program as well uh, within four to six weeks of uh, their submission of their application considering that everything is complete the most common question explains sean blas and jody duenas is an applicant's income level but still it's imperative to understand exactly what homeowner hardships qualify for assistance. There are no income limitations at all. Um, any you can be at any income bracket and come in to apply. You just have to make sure to comply with uh, all of the other sets of rules that we have. The damage is actually the the caveat to being able to apply for this loan. That is the main criteria. They have to have damage to what is called the structure of the home, which is the roof, the um, the roof, the floors, the doors, the windows, that, that, um, and then I think we were, we were also including gates, potentially garages. Okay. Fencing, then, fencing too? Fencing too, depending on, you know, the gate. The deadline for applications to be submitted is the end of September with the outreach located at the former GameStop store at the Micronesia Mall in Dededo every Saturday until September 30th.